the double compressive knot is a new uh, type of suture useful for root tears. We use it in type 2, 3, 4. We drill a tunnel, uh, transoseus, 3.5 mm, ending just in between the two edges of the tear. With the suture passer, we pass our first suture. We uh, make a loop on the lateral part of the meniscus, which is called the body. Then, with the suture passer, we reload the suture, the longer limb, grasp the root of the meniscus, and pull it. And you see that there is a thread in between, which makes the compression. We will do then a second loop, and then you will see that the two loops are connected by the thread. And when you tighten them, you will compress the lesion and you will increase the healing. So we pass a suture uh, shuttle. Uh, we will hold the two limbs of the thread and then tighten it on the under bottom. And you see how efficient it is. Now, on live surgery, this is a type 4 lateral meniscus tear. We palpate it, then we will debride it to have some more bleeding and uh, improve the healing. We use a ACL guide or a specific guide in a figure 4 and the angulation is around 40 degrees. We end the tibial tunnel just in between the two edges of the meniscus. With the suture passer and the thread, we go on the most lateral part of the meniscus, the body, and then we pull the thread and make a loop outside of the knee, and then we will tighten this first loop. You can help yourself with a probe just to position exactly the loop where you want to be and where it has to be the most efficient. Then we uh, reload the suture passer with a longer limb and we will uh, grab the root uh, to have the second loop. This is where we go, very close to the root, as you can see. We pass the suture and then pull it outside of the knee and make the second loop. While we have done that, uh, we will be able to uh, tighten both of them and you will see that the connecting suture or the connecting thread will make the compression between the two parts of your meniscus. And you see how efficient it is. You can tighten it alternatively and then with the uh, shuttle suture we uh, put the two limbs in the lasso and then put it outside where we will fix that on the on the bottom so look at it when we tighten it the two edges of the meniscus have a very good position and this is definitely super efficient. The take home message is that it is good for a lateral root tear, type 2, 3, 4. It's a very cost effective suture because you use only one thread. It has a very anatomic reduction and apposition of the meniscus, the double compressive knot.